Welcome, everyone, to the Everything Show. I am your host, Matrix Lord 212, and I'm with Scott. What's up, Scott? Well, let's see. Batman is going to Guardians of the Galaxy? What? So, we just did a cast, and we said that DC's going to grab somebody mm-hmm. from Marvel for Spike. Mm-hmm. For Spite. Now, just picture this for a second. James Gunn is there. Mm-hmm. Guardians is up in the air. Guardians yeah. 3. He doesn't even know, and he finds out he's in the running to be Bruce Wayne. Chris yeah. Wayne. And here's the thing. Just think about this. Coincidence? Hmm. Think about this for a second. This isn't like a secondary character. No. Bruce Wayne. Batman. Yep. yep. And the they main, say they were looking for somebody within their 20s and 30s for the... Uh, the main effing yep. top tier yep. heroes. Mm-hmm. Yep. If I was a betting person, okay, don't tell me he's going to say no. No, not gonna say no. He's gonna he's gonna try to wiggle his way out of Marv uh, of Marvel, and, and if they well, he don't have him, to wiggle. They flash him a big enough paycheck or run enough uh, dump trucks worth of money, he's gonna say, "Well, folks, it was great being old uh, Mister Star, whoever Star Lord, Star Lord." Uh, now, who was that guy? Who was again? Well, but, but wait, Scott though he he's not. Here's the thing. The moment they didn't film Guardians, he's not yeah. bound. He's not. Nope. That he's contract not. is because they're shooting for the uh, three thousand, the year three thousand version, which we saw a sneak peek of. No, but that. what I'm saying is that contract that was there in place, yeah, is bound by years. That's not. He's not going to. They're gonna have to have a new contract for all of them. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna tell you right now, he's not gonna tell DC no. You would be oh, foolish. Not. You have a multi-pitcher deal. You get yeah. to be your buddy James Gunn. That's right. And you backed him when, and when Disney did him dirty. So if Chris Pratt is Bruce Wayne, I could say 99% possibility that James Gunn will, will be doing that. And direct a Batman movie yeah. with Chris Pratt. That's right. Guaranteed. Uh-huh. And guaranteed and then you could have um you know maybe they could grab somebody else from marvel to play catwoman who knows you know what i'm saying like Probably another one of his little uh of his guardians buddies to play uh yeah maybe not even maybe you know maybe they'll try to grab karen gillen to yeah. be like catwoman or something who knows or poison ivy or whatever yeah I see her more, yeah, I see her more as, uh, as Poison Ivy than I do anybody yeah. else. But I'm just going to, this goes to show you guys that, like, this rivalry with Marvel and DC is real. Yes. It is a hundred million percent real. It's like in the original, it's like in the original days uh, back in the 30s and 40s when, uh, when studios really had, pretty much had people contracted to them. Think about it. Like Paramount had this, per, had these people. Universal had these people. So it's pretty much, it's getting to that particular point. It's actually at that point now. And you know, there is a, something also that will influence this deal with Chris Pratt, and that being that they want Chris Pratt to be Indiana Jones in a real, yep. and Harrison Ford does not want that. Yeah, he doesn't want to come back. In fact, Harrison Ford has it stipulated that if he's going to do Indiana Jones, it's going to be all about him as Indiana Jones yep. and no Chris Pratt, nobody else. If you're going to reboot it, you're going to reboot it after him. Mm-hmm. So here's the thing. They want him bad, but they can't because of this thing with Harrison Ford and they don't want to upset him. He's going to go. To, he's going to go. He's going to go to Warner Brothers. He's going to. They're going to get him. They're going to get him. There's no way. This is a multi-picture deal. Just they're restructuring. They're going to try to make it like he's going to be Batman. 
Yep. They they may have a different Superman in mind. I'm telling you, there's going to be stuff going on here. And if they do, don't do the whole little, oh, I'm dark Superman or semi-dark Superman. Oh, Michael B. Jordan? That, no, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about how they did Superman as though, oh, I'm I'm Superman, but I'm I'm the I'm the emo Superman. I'm dark. Well, that's another thing. If they get Michael Michael B. Jordan, he's still some for some reason he's in Black Panther too. That would be a huge another thing if they get him to be a well, different they version of Superman. Twist with uh, with Perry White. So why not do a mass twist with, uh, with Lex Luthor then? Well, he, no, they want him to be Superman. There's a version of Superman that's black. Yeah. I got to tell you, this, this, again, we talked about this, and we don't talk about this like we're pulling stuff out of our ass. Mm -hmm. we, we researched this stuff. We could see who, and I said they're going to grab somebody big from Marvel. You got or a few people. A yeah, few. And, and, and since he's also out of the running pretty much for Star Trek, that also grants him free time to... Uh, Who's that? Pratt. Star Trek. Well, oh, I'm thinking of somebody else. I thought, wasn't he... Oh, Christopher Pine? Pine. I'm thinking Pine. That's right. Pine's in Wonder Woman 1 and 2. Yeah, and yeah. Not I'm, do I'm, think, I'm getting my Chris's mixed up. Yeah, that's okay. Um, so that's Too many Chris's. And, 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 and another thing is that... Uh, Ben Affleck came out on Jimmy Kimmel. Yep, I just yeah, I saw that. That he's done completely. He's done as Batman. Done. Over. Not gonna happen. Yep. So it's official, official could be. I mean, and you gotta think of it too, if he was gonna be Batman five years from now, how old was he now? Come on. Yeah. You know, you can't. So the only way he could be Batman now is if they do that uh, futuristic one where Nobody wants to see that. that. Not with him. They want to see Michael yeah. Keaton. I know. To be honest. Yeah. All right. So this was a quick everything show. Thank you guys. Take care. Bye for now.